today I'm gonna to show uh, you how to do a capillary stick where it's a glucose stick. Uh, you should check for uh, glucose levels in the blood, uh, sugar levels pretty much. So before you do that, you need to get the equipment. So we have aqua pads, we have a band-aid gauze pad. Um, then we have uh, pretty much a lancet. Uh, so it's a capillary stick, so this is a lancet. This will be the needle that punctures uh, the finger. And then we have our glucometer, and then we have our glucose strips. And then I'll show you one of the strips. So when you take one of the strips out, that's how it looks like. And then you put this in the machine, and the machine will turn on automatically. You'll hear a beep, and it will turn on automatically. Okay. So, now. And. So when you're doing a glucose stick, it's very important the fingers that you use. Your first preference of the finger is always the middle finger, and your second preference is uh, the ring finger. Uh, a lot of people make a mistake here, but this we're gonna use the finger or uh, the ring finger, so we're gonna use these, uh, these two. Okay. First, um, you need to clean the area. It's just one would swipe up the alcohol pad, and you, uh, you can put that aside. And then after that, let the alcohol dry for a little bit, about five seconds. And then she's gonna put the strip into uh, the machine. And she's gonna uh, grab the capillary, uh, the lancet, uncap, put that away, and then put her one hand, uh, finger, uh, thumb on this side, and she's gonna puncture the opposite end. And she's gonna apply a little bit of pressure, press up, press down, and then click. And then she's gonna throw the lancet away into the biohazard. And then let gravity play its part, bring it down and then you just have to squeeze a little bit, let the blood come out, and she's gonna wipe away the first blood because it contains bacteria, so you wanna get, uh, don't mess up the reading of the glucose, and then just apply enough pressure where the blood comes out, and then she's gonna touch the tip of the glucose strip, and the blood's gonna go down, you're gonna hear a beep, and she's gonna take the gauze pad. In five seconds, it will give you a reading on his value. His value falls in, falls in the normal range, which is 70 to 110 milligrams per deciliter. So he has good glu uh, glucose reading. And then when she's done with that, she's gonna give the patient a Band-Aid, take away the gauze pad. And after she's done doing that, then she's gonna do proper cleaning, which is anything that has blood on it, it's gonna go into one biohazard. And anything that doesn't have blood on it, she's gonna throw in the regular garbage. And that is how you do a glucose stick.